Greetings everyone, and welcome back to Pep Organ. Today, we're going to be announcing our Pep Organ Composition Competition for 2023. We did the first one of these last year, and it was an immense success, and you can go back and watch the videos on our YouTube channel to see what happened. So, here's how the competition is going to work this year. I'm going to require you to write a piece of music for organ that is three to five minutes long, and is in the classical style. I define the classical style as music that dates between 1740 to 1790. So that's actually quite a wide range of different composers who you can be influenced by for your piece. Of course, I want your piece to sound like you, but I want there to be a classical influence here. So whether you're inspired by the earlier classical composers, such as Scarlatti, Galuppi, uh, maybe early works of Haydn, or perhaps the later works, such as of Mozart, late Haydn, uh, maybe even early Beethoven, though that's maybe stretching it just a little bit far. Now the reason I chose this style is because in a lot of organ schools we find ourselves going from the Baroque, uh, maybe from early Baroque to late Baroque, with, ending with Bach, and jumping straight to the Romantic period, and we don't really get much classical music that is of high quality and is of um, moderate difficulty. I know there's a lot of easy organ music for manuals, if you're familiar with the English style. Uh, there's music like John Stanley and things like that. But we don't have a more sophisticated style of organ music from this period, particularly um, with pedals. So what I've decided to do is I'm, I'm going to make these pieces three to five minutes long. They must involve the pedals. It doesn't need to be extensive use of pedals, but it just needs to be there. And it needs to be playable on a two-manual instrument. You don't have to use both manuals, but I just want two manuals to be the limit of how far we can go with orchestrations. Focus more on the harmonies and the stylistic elements for this challenge, rather than um, more of a uh, experimental approach. The piece should also be accessible and should be playable in a church context or in a performance context. So I really want it to be playable in all sorts of areas and spaces. Now there's going to be a higher prize pool this year as well to make this competition more interesting. The first prize is going to be $300 AUD, as well as a embroidery, which is handmade by my wife, Kim, uh, and is very special. The second prize will be $150, and there'll also be a third prize of $50. So there's a, a higher chance for you to actually win money with this one. And I don't know any other competition where you're challenged to write something in a classical style rather than something modern. So perhaps we on Pep Organ are doing something unique here, and I hope that you will jump to the occasion and challenge yourself, especially if you haven't written in that style before, to try something new and honestly find how fun it is to write like Beethoven or Mozart did. And of course, just like last year, I will be playing the works of the winning pieces on Pep Organ. So those will be the premieres, and after that, I encourage the entrants to publish the works of themselves and get some more exposure, because this is what this is all about, right? I actually want to promote more modern music, contemporary music as we call it, but in a style that's accessible and appealing to everyone. And so that's what this challenge is about, just like that's what my channel is about. The adjudicators are going to be myself, my wife Kim, who is a non-musician and is going to be providing a non-musician's perspective, and Ben Adler, who was our, another panelist last year. He's a violinist, a professional violinist, a music lecturer, and um, really excellent musician all round. So other than that, the more specific details are down in the description below, so you can find out exactly what you need to do. You've got about a month to write this piece, which I think is ample time. Remember that people like Mozart could compose in a day, so I'm sure that you can do much better than that, uh, being in the modern world that we are and being full of great time and energy. Um, but let's see how we go, and I'd love to see what you enter. I'm really looking forward to this competition. So thanks for watching, and get out there and start composing.